Imagine trying to invent a better fridge, but instead you stumble upon the stuff that keeps the eggs from sticking to the pan. That's literally how Teflon was born. So back in 1938, a chemist named Roy Plunkett is working at DuPont. His job? To find a new type of refrigerant gas. You know, something boringly useful for cooling your icebox. He's messing around with these pressurized gas cylinders. And one day, one of them just stops working. No hiss, no gas coming out, dead cylinder. Now, most people would have tossed it in the bin and moved on. But Roy? He cuts the thing open because science. And instead of gas, he finds this weird slippery white powder coating the inside. Turns out the gas had polymerized. Basically, it had transformed into a solid. Totally useless for fridges. But when he touched it, it was ridiculously slick. It was non-reactive, heat resistant, and almost nothing could stick to it. He just discovered polytetrafluoroethylene, PTFE for short. Luckily, DuPont realized that was terrible branding and they renamed it Teflon. It was first used in the Manhattan Project to handle uranium gas, then in cookware, spacesuits, cables, even coating your cars, all because the cylinder didn't work the way it was supposed to. Sometimes the best inventions aren't the ones we are looking for. They're the happy accidents that you almost throw away. If you like this little story, hit follow to the business scrapbook for more.